knowledge is important, but behavior is more important. And this is something uh, in every interview you will see, it's always, that's why it's always uh, some technical experts are sitting in it and we're checking really, you know. And here, it's, uh, I, my favorite is always if I, thought, I always have a few technical questions. Huh? And then I, uh, I go in depth. You know, if somebody has not understood the subject, that's not really what I'm looking for, huh, guys. Just learning for an exam and pass it, you know, uh, knowing the answers, what the professors expect, that's not sufficient in the industry, guys. We need you to have really deep technical knowledge and maybe not knowing everything, but in certain areas. And that's why I always, you know, I, I listen to the, to the, uh, <coughs> to the interviews, uh, uh, people <coughs> tell me about your um, uh, uh, master thesis. Huh? Then I expect from the guy, if he has done a master thesis, he has depth knowledge. And then I ask, of course, okay, if it's a trailer about math systems or whatever, okay. And then I go in depth. Huh? And then, then I find sometimes out, okay, it looks like, uh, I don't know where he got the information from, but he did not really work on it by himself. Huh? And that's something uh, we need guys who have really in-depth knowledge. Not only scratching the surface to pass an exam, uh, and that's something, uh, but you don't need to know everything, of course. You can also say, no, I, I, I don't know it. Huh? But what you tell me you, you know, you should know in depth. And that's exactly, I think. And then the behavioral side, of course, in, uh, uh, English is a must, in my opinion, in the, in the industry right now, because in uh, Ulmi Petrom is an international company. So, you know, people can talk Romanian, of course, if they, uh, if they talk Romanian, if they are only there. But as soon as somebody else uh, sitting, maybe you're sitting at a lunch in the canteen and uh, you're there, for Romanians, you talk Romanian, but as soon as somebody else joining, you switch to English. And this is something uh, why English is so important, uh, and also in Austria, of course. Eh? Talk, everybody talks Germans, but if somebody is joining, it's automatic English. That's why, and this is something I think the, the skills we need, and, uh, and of course, being open-minded, these are very traditional ones which bring companies forward. Eh? Every recruitment process is a competitive uh, uh, process, guys. Huh? So you mean if you are, uh, if you're applying for a job, uh, then uh, it's always I don't know quite a big number of competition in it. Huh? And this is something where exactly what I meant uh, before, like this asking questions, being uh, proactive, being maybe in an internship uh, with Petrom already, that some people you know know you already, that's always good. And, and if you're in an internship, as again, again, leave a good impression there. Be visible, because you could be an intern and nobody realizes you that you're there, but it's highly compet competitive, actually. And we always, of course, look for the, for the best one. Huh? That's why you know, in a competitive market, that's really something, the best person, and as I said already, does not really need the best techno uh, tec uh, 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 technical person. It's, it's a com combination of different aspects. That's why also the, the people who sit there, it's not only an engineer who, who evaluates that or a geologist, it's always from uh, human resource somebody there. They look on the behavior based and, and also for me, it's very important the behavior side. Huh? And, and that's exactly something, you know, uh, also addressing the, the tough topics. Huh? <laughs>